Let me ask you a question. If you thought something in your city was unfair, would you try and change it? Would you stand up and fight for what you thought was right? Because that's exactly what a bunch of kids did. They changed London, and they changed their lives. Son? Yeah. So you still got me old bike then? Yeah, I polish it every day. Good boy. How's your mum? Yeah, she's fine. So. Right, well, same deal as before. 50 50, down the middle, yeah? Yeah, she. Don't worry, the mugs at school won't know any different. It's not a problem. Just remember, there's no one like you, son, alright? You're living the dream. I'm all about the dream. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Party people in the place. He's the coolest kid alive. Oh my gosh, have you seen how much style this kid's got? It's insane. It's popular. Yeah, yeah, yeah. should have known it was you peddling this filth. Got anything to say? I'm truly happy to announce a further 4% off for all the teaching staff. I'm happy to announce that you're going to see the headmaster. Come on, chop chop. I'll give you 99 Shut percent. up. Oh. You realise the nightmare you have created with these? Headaches, stomach cramps, vomiting, diarrhoea. In many ways, sir, I've, uh, I've done you a favour. Well, any kid that buys toxic chocolate from the black market must lack intelligence. So all I've done is help you identify those in need of academical assistance. Well, you can farm them off to the school down the road and your Ofsted chart thing, well, it will go through the roof. And you know what, sir? It will all be thanks to me. Did someone say outstanding? Sir, did someone say a uh, pay rise? No, but someone said detention. I don't think they did, sir. Detention. <laughs> Now it's probably time to talk about dancing. Dancing was Jaden's thing, the thing that made him feel alive and, well, happy. And since he'd been banned from doing it by his parents, it was the thing he couldn't stop thinking about. He would jump into his head at the slightest opportunity.
welcome to the garage. Welcome to my place. I set this place up for kids like Jaden to come to and just, well, be themselves. there were a lot of people who wanted to knock this building down. Do we have to go through the whole thing again? See, the thing is, though, mm. Councillor Tarrington, some of these kids don't actually have anyone else to go after school. This place is still going to be demolished. What's in it for you? You backhander, is it? Are we... Let's pretend you didn't say that. This is... This, this is the only youth centre around here. The community really needs us. It also needs parking spaces. Oh, come on. Surely kids are more important than parking spaces. Parking spaces bring in more revenue. Anyway, we've still got a couple of weeks before the demolition. I expect I'll see you at the council meeting on the 20th. It'll be a great opportunity for you to beg for mercy and be ignored. Fantastic. Look forward to it. Mm. Goodbye, Gina. You blood. Who the heck is that? Oh, don't even ask. Shutting it down, aren't they? I've got to raise a lot of money, and there is literally nobody else in the world that I can ask. Are you still sure we can, you know, tell them? Oh, Jaden, not the talent thingy again. Come on. We've got an axe from the garage to sell tickets. There's so much talent here, Miss Gina. I don't have the time, I don't have the manpower, I don't have enough hands to deal with, to organise something like that. You'd need someone who can do stuff and get stuff. I could do it. Jaden. I don't you know I'm all about empowerment and everything, but you look about eight. Sorry, maybe eight's a wee bit harsh. Eight and a half. Thanks for that. All right. <laughs> She's on fire She's every man's dream of my desire She's like the candy that your daddy told you You can't touch Oh, she's on fire Just tell me how do you make I love me Don't stay loyal to the game Super fit chick just joined our school. She's called Lucy. She's very unintelligent. She only dates dancers. And she already has a boyfriend. All of these minor obstacles. Thanks, Squirt. Squirt? <laughs> I went to a school like that. Now, I'll tell you what, son, if you get into that school, you can do anything you want with your life. Yeah, apart from being able to relate to girls. <laughs> He's funny. I'll tell you what, you're going to breeze through that entrance exam. Is that my old dance stuff? Yeah, I found it in the attic. Figured you don't need it anymore, so I'm going to give it to charity. Jay, look, we pulled out all the stops for you to go to this school, all right? So you need to focus. No distractions. No more dancing, yeah? Yeah. All right. You've got a brilliant imagination, son. Use it for something proper.
I'll get it. It's cool. You want that? Yeah, I'm good, yeah. Uh, we're still on for tomorrow. Alright. Yeah, it's cool. Um, right, and yeah, yeah. go go as well. Uh, in a bit. But. It's dead. Um, tomorrow. It's not gonna happen. I'm just gonna go to my room and pretend to do homework, you know? <laughs> oh, I got a letter from school. Great, what trouble are you in now? Why'd you always assume it's bad? Sorry. Just tired. Long day. Well, um, it is bad, so happy reading, yeah? It's well weird. Yeah, man. It's um, Space Invaders. It's retro. It's from World War II before they had phones. Cool. Jaden, we're in the same year. Really? Yeah. I know you're good at scams. <laughs> don't make me blush. Oh, it's about a garage. You go there, don't you? <laughs> Are you my stalker? I need you to help me organise a talent show to raise money for repairs. What's in it for me? A happy feeling. Listen, Jaden, I'm going to get that happy feeling when that place gets demolished. It sucks. She's on fire Just tell me how do I make the love me Don't stay loyal to the game oh. What up, y'all? Walk one. Walk one, Lucy. Who the hell are you? I'm Ethan. Did you follow me here? No, oh, that'd be weird. No, I'll just come down, checking out the competition. Oh, you mean full of the year competition? <laughs> well, congratulations. You are clearly the winner of that. <laughs> no, you, you're the competition. It's a dance thing, yo. Me and my crew, we're tight. You sound like you're in Glee. More like Glee BBs. <laughs> <laughs> Give him a chance. So, you good then, are you? We're as good as you are bad. Are you dissing me? Are you being dissed? Well, maybe I should film you being dissed. <sighs> hmm. It seems my phone has been mislaid. Doesn't matter. I'm going to film you with my mind. Let's be honest. 
Wordplay just ain't happening. We need to battle for real. So just set the time and place, and we'll be there. Until then, get lost. And please, don't say anything else. My head hurts. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to go get my phone, I forgot him. Sorry. We're closed. Bye. It says see here. It's in the lost property drawer. Eminem tool. What, like the cheetah of holes? Oh, that's Eminem tool, you idiot. I'm talking about Eminem tool. Like the old American rapper and men tool just. Don't really work, does it? Nah, not really. Forget that and check this. You can't show that to anyone. Did someone say YouTube? Please don't. Okay, listen up. Here's the deal. I want to impress the fittest girl that comes to this school. Ooh, she's, on fire. But she's already going out with this total idiot called Kurt. He's in a crew. So I need to beat him in a dance battle. And I need a crew to do it. But I can't dance and I don't have a crew, so uh, help me, Jaden One. You're my only hope. Don't dance. Duh, he's so good. In public, I mean. I can't. I promise my parents. What if you could do something for me? Apart from deleting that. Now we're talking. Shoot. You help me put on that talent show. Nah, man, that's, that's way more than I need. Hold on, wait. I hope we've put together a crew. Your battle against Kurt could be the main event. What is the point of beating him if no one's watching? You know that. That does sound pretty Eminem to One condition. What's that? You delete the clip and I don't answer the show. It's two. Your point is? I 
I'm obviously not going to shake on it. I didn't really spit. It's just affecting it. Not in a million years. Please, 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 please love. Lovely, lovely Gina. <laughs> All right, admittedly, you make me laugh, but I wouldn't trust you as far as I could throw you. It's only because you're weak. Oh, look, the answer is no. Will you trust me? Don't you, Gina? And we're a team now, me and my assistant, Jane. Equal. Equal, OK. This is so organised, guys. You said I need it. I can't do this. What are you... No, no. No, no, don't stop it. Stop looking at me. Uh, no. Oh, all right, fine. Woo! Thanks. Oh, I'm too old for this. Yeah, and what are you? 30. I'll take that. Some skills. Uh, yeah, but is it entertainment? No, no, What's your problem? problem? You got it wrong! What's your problem? You always What's said your problem? your problem! Yeah, I'm blinking snow for your dish. But do that's all our best in fear, Miss Biz. Dix. Hello, Jaden. Hello, Ethan. I want to be your friend. Back on track. That's more like it. Yeah, he's really good. Really good. Really, really. Please, I'll pass it out. What is it? It's all these acts. Yeah, they're amazing. But... Still need my dance crew, remember? Don't worry. I've got your back. Dance is coming up. Thank you. We were, we'll be in touch. That was great, I thought. Who cares? It's street dancers I need. Because street dancers are already in Chris. How is that going to work? Look, we've still got a few to go, so we'll find people. <laughs> They're so big and manly. I don't have my feet or yours. Yours, obviously. Uh, mummy. Uh, mummy! Who's got big feet? You do. Who's got big feet? You do. Uh, mummy! Tim and Rebecca. Aren't they brother and sister? Big feet, big feet! Oh. You've got big feet! Ha! Ha! Nice balance. Ha! Ha! It's just Amy. I've known her since we were in that. table was broken. Um, that was really great, Amy. It's just not what we're looking for. I really want to help you, Ethan. Security, maybe? You know, need someone big and tough on a door. But I don't want to be on the door. What doorman ever does? What? Um, it's an arm. Sorry, Squirt. Last audition over, and not one street dancer. I'm doomed. Um, am I too late to audition? Uh, yes, yeah, sorry, mate. What's your name? Brian. And you can dance? Yeah, and, and I do music, remixes. Yeah, um, I'm sorry. I'm just not sure your image is right for us. You look like a rapper going on a hunt. Come on, give him a chance. <laughs> Was 
you're not in the crew? None of them wanted me because I'm fat. And they think I dress weird. And that I can't really dance. Oh, I can't argue with any of that. How would you like to join one? What? I'm sorry, one minute. What? The music was amazing. He's keen and talented. He's talented and... How am I meant to be taken seriously? You mean my crew? I'm meant to look cool. Is that what you think dance is about? Yeah. <laughs> it's dancing, though. It's mental. Enthusiasm counts for a lot. OK, mate, you're in. Uh, oh, that's, that's cool. Thanks, guys. I'll, I'll see you soon. So that's, um, me, that chubby kid in tweeds, and, uh, maybe you. OK, not you. Oh. You got any ideas? We may need to think outside the box here. Welcome to the All Stars. Why are we called that? Because although you have completely different talents, you're All Stars. Brilliant. That's the dumbest name for anything I've ever heard. Peanut? I can't. I'm allergic to them. Chocolate? To tell you, I'm also lactose intolerant. Lolly? I just threw up in my mouth a little bit. We're battling another crew and it's going to be the main event. We'll beat them and people will pay to watch. Yeah, this crew's what's going to save the garage. Ethan, don't know how to dance. Then why are you here? Look, Rebecca and I are used to putting in hours of training. So your little row dancing thing will be no problem. It's called street dance? Sure it is. But who else we got to dance it? You, king of the burgers, my little ninja. <laughs> no offence. None taken. I do love burgers. Taken. One more comment like that and I'll smack you all the way back to St. Trinian's. Sorry, did you just threaten me? It's on, hockey sticks. Uh, Amy. Please. All right. So who's going to teach us and make up the dancing and that? She means the choreographer. Jaden? Sorry, do you even dance? I used to. Prove it. But it's just between us. This is redonkulous. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, whatever. Alright. Oh. Squat, you going practice? Yeah. What happened to your bike? Ah, it's broken. <laughs> Missing someone. Hello. Oh, hey Brian, how are you doing? Oh, hey Tony, yeah, cool, mate. Um, I will have the usual, please. Oh, one of Brian's special coming up. Cheers. How's the family doing? Yeah, they're good, thanks. That's good, cool. See you tomorrow. Traffic. Did a lot. Um, you're more robotic. 
Kurt's crew, they do great robot moves. We have to be better than them. Okay, try beep. <laughs> That's a, not a very robotic. We need to go back to basics and adjust the place. Come. Okay, let's get military. Physical agility and balance. I'm going to split you into two units. Emmy, you're with me. Recon. Got it. Ethan, you follow with the rest. Elite squad. Kind of. Rendezvous. On the side of that log. You mean four feet over there? You've got a problem with that soldier. No, sir. Good luck. Elite squad, go, go! Rebecca, you might just want to touch up your makeup just a bit. Just like here. Your time is coming, Karate Kids. That's what we do. I thought we were quite a uh, military, actually. Oh, gotta go. What? I've got a mock exam tonight. Oh, my parents are so going to kill me. After trying to revise, I've got 20 minutes. Okay, bye. It's training over, sir. I'm going to be late for the golf, sir. Um, just going to play on. Can I ask you something? Yeah. Alright, uh, cool. Well, um, uh, say, say a boy and wanted to ask a, a girl on a date. Okay. What would be a cool thing to do on a date? You know, the perfect first date. Well, uh, you start with a meal, a meet Peter Peter, to share. Then a movie. It doesn't have to be too girly. Finally, a walk home, under the street lamp, holding hands. They share a kiss. Maybe they don't. What well, yeah, Lucy would love that. Lucy? Yeah, you know what, I'm, I'm trying to come up with that. The perfect first date for when we beat Kurt and she dumps him. But no, thanks, Kurt. Cheers for all the advice. Much appreciate you. Yeah. Are you sure you've been revising, Jamie? Yeah. Just so much revision. There's this guy, Ethan. He's doing the exam as well. We're revision buddies. No dancing or anything? Absolutely not. We filled about 12 in, right? Yeah, out of 200. Still got three days, though. Come to the garage. I don't know. My dad's meant to be picking me off, isn't he? He's, he's not the most reliable guy. I don't think he's coming. Parents suck sometimes. You know. Your mum and dad's still on your back about that whole test thing. They want me to go to a private school. It's going to be the end of my life. Who cares what parents think? I couldn't care less if my dad turns up today or not. You know why? Because I'm my own man, my own guy. You get me? Listen, they think I'm revising tonight. Let's go to the garage and crack your dancing. What's wrong with it? Pretty much everything. Forget your feet. Forget, forget my feet. Yeah, forget them, but control them. Now float with them. Boom. Boom. Let me lead you. I don't know what that means, but. Dude! You're in heaven. 
Judging's improving. Yeah, keep up the good work, man. But it won't stop me doing it to your face. Circle crew is a joke. You two think you're so much more awesomer than the rest of us, don't you? First of all, awesomer isn't even a word. Google it. And secondly, uh, yeah, we do, you chubby fun star. Oi! Can, can we all just calm down? No. I refuse to share a stage with a bunch of lameoids. Look stupid in front of a ton of people. Not for the carriage. Not for you, Ethan. Not for anyone. Come on, Tim. We're out of here. You are not the boss of me. Now, Tim! Fine, maybe I'll just catch up. Just don't think you'll ever be a crew. You know what? On our own, you're probably right. But that's why we need you in the crew. I said I'm not dancing. Just give me one more chance to convince you. Please. So where are we going again? Some kind of a dancing show? Did we start looking cool now? You are, mate? <laughs> Such a low voice. <laughs> Sorry. How old are you guys? Do your mums know you're here? Yeah. You're not getting in? But, um, <clears throat> I'm a mate of the DJ. Which one? Bob. Bob. Bob the DJ. There were big fans of Bob the DJ here. However, that's a tenner each. You hurry up, you might get the last bit of the show. Sure. Cybernetic. They're relatively good at dancing. Do you have change for 250s? Shoelaces. Actually, I gave up trying after four weeks. I'm rocking the bad boy Velcro now. Those are fantastic Velcro shoes. So, you enjoy the shot? Clouds of links. Dancing man. So, this must be that amazing crew you're in shut up about. Wait till you see what we can do. And where will I be able to do that? Go to Psychic. In two weeks from now, Garage Talent Show. A venue as truly lame as you. What are you saying about the garage? It's full of gimps, like you. <laughs> You're a genius, man. Mate, if you want to bottle it. I didn't say that. You don't have to go through with this, Kurt. It'd be a pleasure destroying you in front of your home crowd. But you can't even dance. Yeah, well, I can. But you're not even in the crew. And two! Allergic to limbs. We're out of here. See you later, Ethan. He is definitely unintelligent. Yeah. We have to beat him. Oh, no. 
I'm in. <laughs> Did I miss anything? Feel like a fight. Go for it again. You guys, come on. Yo, Jaden, what's good? Lacking any star. Crumpawera. It's like crumping with capoeira, but just together. You're still funny. <laughs> um, I need advice. Oh, I'm helping someone out, trying to train a crew. You're training another crew? Yeah. So you're not allowed to dance with us, but you're able to train another crew? None of them can dance. Like, I want to help them, but, well, you can see my problem. Well, what can they do? Um, argue with each other, be distracted, and eat too much. <laughs> Anything else? Um, I don't know, some kind of martial arts, weird ballroom moves and terrible clothes. Chubby jiggling around. Then they can dance. No, they can't. I've tried. Tried what? To teach them, to change them. It ain't the same thing. In fact, they're kind of the opposite things. I don't get it. Think about it. So, um, why are we dressed like this? You know what will make this crew win? We will. By doing the things we already do. Amy, kick me. What? <sighs> Come on, kick me with one of those spinning. <laughs> <laughs> oh. See how graceful that was? That was dance. Brian, play us some music. Something Amy ish. Now dance to me. This is what you do. I'm so happy you're dancing again. Oh, oh, keep it quiet. Keep it quiet, yeah. Whoa! My dad spent ages collecting this. Yeah, man. What is all this junk? How come your CDs are so massive? Because they're records. Vinyl. Vinyl? Here, I'll show you.
fitting with Rebecca. They don't mind looking stupid, but me, you have to forget about what looks cool. Like this. May I have the stars? Well, certainly, my darling. Every single dream I die from above is a dream come true. Jaden, refresh us. Keep your blood sugar up. Cool. Knock him dead, son. Thanks.
Pencils down now, please. I said pencils down. How'd it go? Really, really well. Finished early. Hold well on, matey. I knew you would let us down. Plan spin. One, two, three. Yeah, not bad. Yeah, you're not that bad. What are you listening to? My Van Halen. Is that a rapper? <laughs> no, man, she's a DJ, plays uh, guitar music. Yeah. My dad's well into her. Yeah. OK, let's keep dancing. Oh, no. Why are you on my dance space? Because your dance space is going to be demolished this weekend. Hello, Mr. Workman. Can I help you? Well, I'm just taking some readings so the demolition goes smoothly this Saturday. Um, well, we haven't actually had the appeal yet. We might stop this whole thing. <laughs> yes, that's right, because the appeal process is very fair. Yes, there's a very good chance that we will not definitely be destroying this building on Saturday. When exactly was this decided? Because these guys are having a talent show on Saturday and there's going to be hundreds of people coming. Hey, well, uh, maybe one of the acts can be a bulldozer driving through the walls. I'll show you the way out. Whatever, we're finished anyway. Okay, guys, let's clear out. All right, boys. Tools in. Whoa. Yeah, yeah. Wait, she's gonna win the appeal, right? Yeah, yeah, she's good at that song. I'm more worried about the fact she thinks hundreds of people are coming. No one even knows about it. Yeah, we need to make those posters. Like, better versions of those posters. Yeah, about that. What? I know, the coffee guys did it. But we can't afford to get them printed. We need big. We need colour. We need money. What you need is me. Good morning, Ethan. Hello, sir. Sorry about this. You know where you're going, don't you? I can't believe we're bunking off school. I feel so rebellious. No, I'm sick. I'm going to puke. Man up, Timothy. So, here we are again, Ethan. Indeed. Wait here. makes a gravy. Your gym makes me sad. And your canteen. You don't even have sushi. I prefer pies. And I like our gym. Now come on. Parents, actually. I'll get on to it now. It's pink. And there's no wee things. And it smells nice. We're in the girls' toilet. Yeah, I feel you say. Wow, that was a bit pointless. Yeah. What, so that's it? And you didn't say anything? Worst moment of my life. Clearly, I spoke too soon. Sorry, that happens when I'm nervous. Someone in there? No, just me, a girl. Doing a wee sitting down. Then why can't I see your feet? Uh, I don't have any. Then how'd you get in there? Uh, I hoped. That's one leg, not no leg. Sorry. Wow, that was a bit pointless. We really are a couple of very strange boys, I know that. Staff room. The printers are in there. Where was he?
took your time, so. She's dad in. Kind of. Kind of. See you later, Ethan. It's great. OK, yeah. See you. Dad, I'm home. Did you have an all right day? I had a good day. Fish fingers OK again? You taking your pills, yeah? You should have seen what we did. We made these posters, which were amazing, but we nearly got caught, but it's fine. And Ethan gave me a lift home afterwards, which was, you know, nice of him. Sounds great, sweetheart. It was. It really was. How's your day, Dad? Really good. and wearing dresses. You like punching people in the face. But I can help you with this. So what do I do? Problem is, when he looks at you, he sees the girl he's known his whole life, the one who lives next door, a square. Now, I'm not saying change who you are, not for a boy. You just need him to notice you again. How? Kind of like... Thank my lucky star. 
real, real. You feel me? Feel you? No thanks. Guys, man, just, just listen up. Listen okay. Up. So we're here to learn about some b-boy attitude. A big part of b-boy in this MC. -ing. The two are inseparable, really. Like Shostakovich and Timpani. Right. Let's just do some rapping. How on earth do we do that? Take something you like. Anything. Bikes. Okay. So just be like, riding on my bike, it's a thing that I like. Don't ride no trikes because I'm down with my... Spike. <laughs> bike, man. Bike! Yeah. Yeah. That's hot. That does sound easy. You could do it, Timothy. You know I hate being called that. Go on, then. <clears throat> okay. Right. <clears throat> so, I quite like fishing. Fly fishing, fly fishing. Gonna get more fish than I've been wishing. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> what, what's wrong with that? Yeah, but Tim, you fly fishing, man, that's... That's already a thing. Uncle Hector does it, with the big wellies. So, I thought this whole MC thing was about breaking rules. Yeah, that's right. Okay, that's right. check it. <clears throat> fly fishing, fly fishing. Gonna get more fish than I've been wishing. What's this in my hand, a fat cookbook? Who's that stuck on my hook? It's you. Break it down. <laughs> yeah! Did you know? Your small associates. Small? Sorry. <laughs> I'm Valerie. I'll be presiding over the hearing. Well, this is uh, Jaden from the garage. Hi. And Ethan. Oh, hi. Yeah, I'm sorry. I've got a text. I'll be with you in five. He's small, but he's very busy. Uh, thank you so much for hearing our appeal. Well, as far as I'm concerned, there should be more places like this. Of course, other pressures do apply. Indeed they do. You... Uh, Simon. You look wonderful today, Valerie. When did I last see you? Oh, it was the case of the old people's home that you were trying to turn into a... Carpet superstore, Your Excellency. But you get a nice new carpet out of that, did you? Nice bit of white shag pile, was it? Shall we all go in and hear the case for the Remand Centre? Youth Centre! I'll have none of your games on this side. Games? <sighs> Good luck, Gina. This is big. Ah, this is big. Lucy just texted me. She asked where I was and she wants to meet. Turns out she's just round the corner. Okay. Well, um, how do I look, you know? It's normal. It's good. Ethan. Hey, Lucy, how's it? Sorry. This is hilarious. Kissy, kissy time, big boy. We can't let money decide the fate of our children. Money doesn't care. Money doesn't know what is important. So 
Why are we letting it make decisions about what's happening in our lives? What, what is that all about? When did that happen? I'm talking about libraries, Sure Start centres. I mean, closing them, totally insane, because people need that kind of stuff. They, they, they just do. And if you close the garage, if you shut the garage, then you're going to be selling these kids short too. Why should they pick up the tab for bankers' mistakes? Just putting it out there. I mean, they're kids, they're children for God's sake. Communist. <coughs> Look, they, they need a place where they can just be themselves. A place that is not their, their failing schools or their broken homes. A place where they can just have a bit of fun and, and be safe. A place where they can grow. And that's a precious thing. It's far more precious than a car park. Yes, it is. Well, can't just went into the show. Let's get this out of the way now. I mean, there's no way some lame show is gonna save that doll. Just you wait, me and my mates. Mates, you know that no one actually likes you, right? Not your so-called mates, not my girlfriend, not even your own dad. <laughs> One more thing, the world that we have ended up living in, the one that we think is good enough for our kids, well, do you know what? It's not. And it's places like the garage that are so important. What's happening? Ethan! Jaden! He attacked him out of kids. This is a sad sight. Ethan, what were you thinking? He said my dad doesn't care about me, but he does. Very unfortunate timing. It was going so well in there. Not anymore. Right, let's, let's all go and vote, shall we? Time to choose between a, a lovely car park and a centre for violent children. I'm so disappointed in you, Ethan. Well, I'm disappointed in you. No, I never should have got involved. You dragged me into this, Jaden. The whole thing was your idea. No, I don't know why I ever cared about you. And that stupid sensor and that stupid crew, I'm out. What am I going to tell the others? I don't care. Not about you, not about them, not about anything. Well, there's not really any point in me going back in there, is there? It's a real shame, Jaden, because I think the show was going to be really good. Please, Gina, couldn't we just still do it's it? It's cancelled. Isn't going to be a building for us to even have it in. This is a disaster. So it was a fight about Lucy? Look, I don't understand either. All he said was that he doesn't care anymore about any of us. And that it's over. Well, I have to say, this is jolly disappointing. We're getting quite good as well. Mum went mental when I told her. I don't know what all the fuss is about. You're a kid, right? Getting these scraps is what kids do. Your mother gets very easily upset. Next, we'll be having a pop at you for playing with your Lego. <laughs> Don't worry, she get over it. Yeah, no. No, I, um, I was just thinking. What? what, what no, what if um? What? What if I lived here with you instead of with mum? Or just half the time, because, you know. Yeah. Um, yeah. Look, we could go out and uh, do stuff like, together. I don't know, son. I mean, don't get me wrong, I'd love you to. It's just that, you know, what we're selling and stuff, I mean, I've got to go everywhere, you know? I've 
I've got to swoop at a minute's notice. And I can't have... Yeah, I just don't think it'll work, son. Anyway, these mates of yours, these so-called mates, or should I say mugs, you're right to drop them. And there's two types of people in this world. I mean, there's people like me, and then... So am I a mug? Because I'm not you. Well, I mean... Well, yeah, you are. I mean, you're like me, I mean. Like lone wolves just running together. You can't tie us down. Looking out for number one. You know what I mean? No, I don't. Well, first of all, we can't exactly be lone wolves together or else we're not exactly lone, are we? Look around you, Dad. Is this running free to you? Because, you know, it looks like a crappy bedsit to me. Is this better than being with your family or being with me? Just pick him up from school, you know, whatever, having a kick about. Just being normal. Not being a dad. Well, I'm not a wolf, Dad. Just so you know, yeah? Need for you. Oh, and I haven't played with Lego since I was eight, so you can stop getting it for me every birthday and every Christmas. Thanks. Twenty-eight percent. Twenty-eight percent. You get twenty-five percent for just spelling your name right, Jay. I never really revised. So what were you doing all this time? Dancing. Dancing. It makes me happy, Dad. Stop dreaming. I can't. You know what? I've had enough of this. We're putting the house on the market and we're moving to somewhere quiet. And you know what? Until we move, you're grounded. Hey, Tony. Oh, hey, is this Elise Dallas? No. Give me two ultimate maxi burgers and an extra large milkshake. I'm eating myself happy. All right. No. Um, I'm sorry. That's the last one. You know, I just don't want to turn out like dad. You're not your dad either. And then, it's my friends. We'll go and sort it out then. Yeah. Ah, it's you. It's through here. It's just she never let me in before. That's because I used to care what you'd say. Oh, Mr. Lewis. Your dad is. Is he okay? No. He's been like that ever since Mum left. Sorry. Didn't know. Why are you bothered? Apparently, you don't care about any of us anyway. Oh, I, I do care about you. I messed up. Yep. Once I mess it up. Sorry. Say it again. I'm very sure. Fine. I'm happy with that. Me too. It sounded genuine. I need one more. A longer one. I'm very sorry that I ruined the appeal with Gina and that now the garage is going to be demolished. But guys, I still want to do the show because you're my friends. Good. That's acceptable. But what about Jaden? I'll talk to him. And the fact that Gina's cancelled the show? Just because she's given up. I don't mean we have to. If you let adults make our decisions for us, then we're going to have one messed up world. But how are we supposed to do this? We're just a bunch of kids. Just a bunch of kids with a bunch of posters that we made and I stashed in my dad's locker. Remember them?
stop worrying about looking cool. Look, I'm, I'm sorry. For what I did. If I knew that I was going to ruin the show, then obviously yeah, I wouldn't. Punish it, accepted. Okay, because the show's back on. Everyone's involved. Just need you, man. No. Why? Th this could be the last chance to show your parents what you're all about. I've let my parents know enough. Right. Check one, two, come in, over, repeat, come in, over. I'm right behind you, Lamoid. And if school finds out that we borrowed all this equipment, empty their theatre rods. It's normal school for both of us, right? Sounds pretty good to me. Over and out. Ladies, thank you. Can I just come back, please? Thank you. Uh... Red alert. Whale has beached. Repeat, whale has beached. Whale's a bit harsh. Oh, hi, Gina. You're... You're nothing, you're nothing like a whale. You're more like a sleek porpoise. It's all right, then. Oh, and here he is, the man of the hour himself. Now, I distinctly remember telling you that this whole thing was cancelled. So, everybody, can you just stop no. what you're doing no, Gina, and I'm leave sorry. now? Gina, I'm sorry I went behind your back, but I knew you'd say no. And well, how very astute it. of you. You can't stop now. We've got a full house. Look, it's... just look. Ethan, mm -hmm. is this one of your scams? Like everything else that you do. We've raised a ton of money from the tickets. We might actually make The bulldozers are arriving at three. Well, that's 45 minutes, so. Oh. I mean, where's Jaden? What have you done with Jaden? He's been uh, sensible. I like sensible. Do you? Well, you also like the garage, and you like fun, crazy, and stupid things. So please, Gina, let us be fun, crazy, and stupid just one more time. Forty-two minutes. Go, go, do it now. Whatever. Here. <laughs> Which is good. Um, okay, everybody, so uh, 
sit back and enjoy the show. Thank you. There's something coming up the road. It's quite big. Women and children, some kind of talent show. I should be rubble by now. Oh, I love talent shows. Gonna take this to the very top. Touchy. Jaden, we need you, man. Look, we've got smart shirts. Ethan got them printed. Look, just play some bigger routine with us. Love you, man. Like completely. I love you. You're like family. In fact, I love you more than my actual family. I'm gonna do a rap. Jaden, Jaden. One, two, three, we, we love, love you, Jaden. <laughs> Bully with dancers here, we need you. There's more dancing, it's an emergency, so please come. Go, 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 go on. Tell the mayor it's Simon from the Seychelles. Uh, we played polo together. Hey, just, I'll ring you back. What is this? What? No, get off. the vanilla pods for the smoothies uh, for the team, morale boosting. Right, because uh, if I thought you were going to do something dangerous... Absolutely, absolutely not. Do you think we'll win? Nope. Just tip Tim. I'm sorry, I'm just saying it as it. Are the All-Stars ready to be all this rated? That doesn't really work, so whatever. Right, excuse me, then. Uh... Life's good, money's good and poor. No, that people like, like life's good, money's good and poor. No, that people like life's good, money's good and poor. Out of the way, please. Give me the phone. Right, right, fun's over, everybody. I'm sure you can all read. Out of the way, please. I need access to the stage. Thank you. And you lot on the stage. Off you go. Go on, pop it. Your attention, please. The official deadline for the closure of this centre has now passed. Every single one of you is trespassing and must leave so that this building can be torn down. Too late! Please leave in an orderly fashion. Thank you. Yeah. 
Oi! You put your hands on my son, you see what happens. Right, Dad? You alright, Ethan? Yeah. Good, thanks. Um, thanks for coming. No, that's right. I was just passing and uh, just thought I'd. Um, oh, I really wanted to see it, so. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry. It's cool. Yeah, maybe being a wolf isn't so good after all. <laughs> yeah, anyway, just. Um, so you got to say. Thank you. So, uh, so guys, we're nearly there. We can easily make it. Just need a few more quid. So please dig deep. Thank you very much. It's not going to make any difference. We are cleared for demolition. You can raise double, triple. My men will still crush this place. Sit down, Simon. <laughs> Life's good, but he's good to put in all that people. Like, like, life's good, but he's good to put in all that people. Life's good, but he's good to put in all that people. Like, like, life's good, but he's good to put in all that people. Life's good, but he's good to put in all that people. Like, like, life's good, but he's good to put in all that people. Life's good, but he's good to put in all that people. Like, like, life's good, but he's good to put in all that people. Just a little technical thing going on. We'll be with you in a minute. He's gonna come, trust me. I know he's gonna come. But is he actually coming? I hate to say it, but so is not. He just has to, though. Mm. Right? Okay. Uh, wait, oh, well. wait! We can buy more time. Come here. The others, you go wait down there for a bit. What? And you. Ethan and Amy. <laughs> DJ, so slow. Light, so nice. Well, this is nice. Yeah, it's not bad. So, how long do you want to do this for? Me hands up. All right, cool. Am I interrupting something? Let's do this. You can't! I'm in front of everyone. Just let him do it. It's 
just in one minute. The galaxy was under threat. Only six people could save with the power of dance. Brian, Ethan, Tim, Rebecca, Jane, and Amy. 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 Let's do this. 